Hey guys and gals, welcome to Sweet Project Cars with cool trick and affordable ways for the do-it-yourselfer and simple ways. And Julio is with us too. Alright, let's get right at it. Today I'm going to share with you how to make your glass on your vehicle from your side mirrors to your side glass to your front windshield to your back glass as good and beautiful as it possibly could ever be. Throw out the rain -X, throw out everything you've ever known because this is going to blow your mind. Now the product we're going to be using, we've used for years, you're going to love it. So let's get right at it. First we're going to use the pre-wash on the glass and you can see how dirty it is. You see the little spot right there. It's just filthy. So we're going to put the pre-wash on. And we like to put it in a smaller bottle. It doesn't come in a bottle like that, but Julio. Tell everybody where all the tools are located. Buscar en el show más de la descripción de video para todas las herramientas. Thank you, Julio Cesar Chavez Rodriguez, Jorge Johnson, Clint Eastwood. Now we're going to take a piece of Scotch Brite. It'll be in the tools list, and we're going to go over the glass like this. Now I'm just going to do the one side here because then we have don't have to change the uh, location of where I'm at. And you just very lightly go over it. Doesn't hurt the glass or anything like that. Then we'll take our awesome microfiber towels that we use, best on the planet. And you just take and buff that off and clean. Now if you have embedded water spots that you can't get off, then you'll have to use uh, mothers and a buffing tool will have all that in there for you. you just go over it lightly with the mothers and the buffing tool and it will remove every bit of water spot stains on your glass real simple it'll be right in the description in the show more will this keep frost and ice from yes frost ice will not be able to stick to your glass, bugs will not be able to stick to your glass, dirt will not stick to your glass, water barely can stick to your glass. You will not probably have to use your windshield wipers very often. All right, now we did that side there, so now I'm going to take our old 99 right there. We we'll just spray that down. And I'll do the other side of the glass later. That way I'm not walking in front of you. We'll take our other beautiful microfiber and this is going to assure ensure that there's absolutely no grease or grime on your glass you should be able to do your whole car in less than 20 minutes especially if you have somebody helping you a trained monkey can clean the glass like <laughs> I just did you've seen it happen right in front of your eyes I'm a trained monkey We'll open that up and get it from the other side, make sure it's really dry. There's nothing more you can do to make your glass more slippery and more beautiful and stick free to anything that lands on it than what I'm sharing with you right now. And they're having some awesome Black Friday sales going on too, and the link will be in there for you. We've been using this product for years and years and years. So what we're going to do now is take the applied cloth that they give you, the supplied cloth and the pad, and we're going to flip the lid up. And this stuff is way more advanced than the last videos you've seen me do where you had to really buff hard to get it off there. You don't have to do that here. So now all I'm going to do is go in one direction, down, up, make sure you get the whole thing. This is how easy it is to do the body panels on your vehicle too. Now we're going to add a little bit more. I like to put about 20 drops or so on. Now we're going to go this way. And I saved that other side not being done for multiple reasons. I'm going to share with you how the water does not beat off that. We'll let that dry to a light haze 
and flash dry and then we'll buff it off with our really good microfibers. Now let me go over there and I'll show you how bad the glass is before we share with you how good this will be. All right, watch this. What are you squirting on? Just plain water. Doesn't bead off at all. It runs down from gravity only. Look how slow and lethargic those are. Not good. We'll be back in about five minutes to buff this off and show you the results. It's ready to buff off. It's been about 15 minutes and about 68 degree weather here in Pensacola. And if you look at it, you can kind of see these blue streaks across it. It's pretty easy on glass to tell when it's dry, but another way to tell when it's dry is to run your finger up it. And if your finger doesn't have anything on it, you're good to go. So let's buff this thing out. Then we'll let it set for a bit and then I'll come back and spray water on it and you'll see the difference. Just light buffing. We'll flip the cloth. Now what I did was I did the other side of the glass over there while I was waiting so I could catch and do the whole glass at one time. So that side's done. And it may take a couple of these microfibers to get it buffed in beautiful. Now I'm going to come around on that side. Now we're going to use our gray cloth. They're the same as the blue. Just a different color. Then they give you in the package a microfiber you can use and I use that last when I'm fully done. And the best temperature is about 70 degrees, not in the sun. But after you get it done and buffed out, set it in the sun. All right, and I'll finish buffing that off, off the camera. I'll let it set for about an hour, and then I'll come back and spray it with water and show you the difference. All right, we let it set for about an hour or so. Look at the shine on that glass. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that light up in the ceiling reflecting in it. Watch this. It's magical. Sweet Project Cars out. GoPro stop recording.